What's up, everybody? Favis here with another episode of Magic Duel's Battle for Zendikar, and we're gonna we're gonna change things up a little. I mean, I know I've been doing a lot of <clears throat> excuse me um, green, so we're gonna do red. We're gonna, we're gonna go into red because I like red. That's my favorite color. My decks, and I'm going to show you what I consider the best deck in whoop, whoops the best deck in the format. And so we're going to do a yeah, quick, 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 quick little deck tech right now. And then we're going to get in for three games, uh, probably three wins, because this is, uh, this is, this is the best deck. Uh, three, three episodes, <laughs> cards of Goblin Glory Chaser. Uh, this guy gets around everything. Uh, early, early game. Uh, for, first of all, let, let's, let's not get into the, the actual decks, uh, cards. Let's, let's just, look, look, I'm not going to give you a list. Here's, here's the list. All right, this is it. These are the cards. Now, there's a theme here, obviously. Uh, there's nothing that costs more than three mana, right there, boom, and Chandra, boom, that's it. Nobody else. So the majority of the deck costs uh, two uh, and one. Uh, unfortunately, I, I have 21 there. I'd, I'd rather have like 20, 20, and, and four, but nah, fuck that. Uh, I am only running 16 lands. That means most of the time, uh, if you have at least two lands, you're going to win. Uh, you have a viable deck. Uh, I have this in here. This is probably the most likely card to get cut if if anything ever comes around to replace it. I don't know. Maybe with a, a perilous mirror or some kind of artifact or something. In fact, maybe we can maybe we can take a, a quick. Wow, there's a lot of cards in there. Maybe we can take a quick peek uh, to see any any single card. Like maybe this guy. He can't attack attack alone. <clears throat> hmm. You know what? I want to give him a shot. He, th this is your time, buddy. I'm only gonna have one shot of him in here. And this actually fixes some things up. No, it doesn't. Never mind. It's the same, same fucking casting class. Whatever. Uh, so very, very low. Uh, most of the cards that you draw are not going to be lands. They're going to be uh, creatures and things. Well, I guess that's true for any deck. But uh, you, you, you don't need a lot of lands for this deck. You need to be very, very aggressive. You've seen uh, cards like this and this before. Um, there's a lot of synergy here. I, ha I think I've played this before. Uh, on camera, it's not really a camera, is it? But versus match, yeah. All right, we can make this happen. Yeah, I, I think I have played this before. Maybe not uh, in its entirety. Maybe I haven't really shown you everything that goes into it. I'd like to. I, I mean, I'm, I'm going to show you right now. No, no big deal. All right, finally, let's get this going, guys. Guys. Let's get this going. Uh, ooh, that's a weird avatar. I, I he just Voldemort, right? I mean, that's that's Voldy-Volds. smacking Harry Potter around. Except he got really tired of not having a nose, so he just like carved in a couple with a with a, a couple of sharp spoons. Butt rot. <laughs> I love this guy. All right, this is what? okay. Well, uh, in case you guys didn't know, uh, this is not the kind of hand that you'd want to keep. So yeah, there we go. That's much better. And I go first, and I'm just, uh, I'm going to put down Goblin Glory Chaser, because that uh, tends to do a little more damage. Because I'm probably going to be able to get in there. Uh, he very likely does not have very many one drops, if any. So the Goblin Glory Chaser is going to get in there for at least one, and then from now on, he's going to be hitting for two for quite a bit. Uh, mostly because even if he has a single creature, uh, it's going to have Renown, so he's not going to be able to block it. Goblin Arsonist is a little... Hey, hey, that... All right, that land really wanted to be played. Uh, Goblin Arsonist is also another good card. But... Uh, it, it's usually a little better, like... Um, it, it's not going to do as much damage as uh, Goblin Glory Chaser. And that's really the reason you want to go with Glory Chaser first, first round. He's way better. He's way better. Uh, looks like Chandra is going to be coming down next turn. And then, if, if he doesn't have any, any creatures to block, I mean, I hope he has a fucking creature to block here, otherwise he's in some shit. Actually, it's going to be turn three that I'm going to... Yeah, he's probably going to play here. He's playing red-black. Red-black's got a lot of cheap uh, cheap things to play with, so I'm sure he's... He, yeah, he does have a play. It's paused on his first main. What's he want to do? He's looking at the removal or a creature. Creature's a good choice. Okay, so is Chandra going down now? Hmm. Hmm, 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 hmm. Hmm, 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 hmm. Um, the 
bully has to swing in, so I think... He, I mean, he's up, he's probably going to block, so I'm going to drop Dragon uh, Fodder down first. That'll buff my bro up because of prowess, and now this is almost an unblockable field. Almost. Sort of, kind of. Come on, you two. You two, get in there. No, both of you get in there. I am lagging just a little bit, and it's uh, kind of annoying. Don't like that. So five damage. He probably he can't block the two two. He probably wants to block the three three. It's going to be really hard for him to swing in because I've got you know two creatures that'll kill him. I will. Do I want to put the arsonist? Yeah, I'm going to put down the arsonist. Fuck it. He's going down. We're we're going all in today, baby. We're going beat stick time. Beat stick. <laughs> <clears throat> God, I wish this was an, an instant. I really need an instant speed removal right now, so I can get Chandra out of here. I want to slap her down, attack with her, cast the instant speed removal, uh, untap her, kill whatever blocked her, and then... Oh, he's gone. And then uh, switch her into a planeswalker. Well, this guy uh, unfortunately didn't have a whole lot happening, so that that's kind of a shame for him. Oh, that's a... That's almost relevant, kind of. <laughs> Not like 100%, but hey. Ooh. Ooh, baby blue. That's not good for you. It's not good for you at all. Who do I put it on? I know who I'm going to put it on. You! And that's probably game. Honestly, I, I, I don't know what, what they can be doing right here. Uh, that is a lot of damage coming in. I'm not holding anything back for blockers. I don't care. Computer will probably block something with a 2-1. One. The 1-2 obviously blocks one of the 1-1s. Uh, one probably not the arsonist, though. Oh, he did block the arsonist. Um, I guess it doesn't matter because that thing has f first strike. But Child of Night is dying. Why would you double block that? That's really weird. Like, really, why would you double block that? Uh, how much damage is getting through? 1, 2... 8, 10. Uh, that's game. That is game. So, that, that's game. And and that Child of Night never even got to do its damage. That's really stupid. If it had blocked one of the tokens, you would have gained two life. But in this case, because the first strike damage from the bat came through first, um, Child of Night never got to even deal damage, so it just died instantaneously. Like, literally nothing you do matters right now, because I'm just going to exquisite Firecraft you as soon as I have my three mana open, and you're dead. Like, nothing you do matters. Like nothing matters this is you're dead yeah all right oh that's why you did that okay well it, it still doesn't matter so boom and even if for whatever reason that doesn't work i still got my twin bolt with my chandra so we're we're all set i mean <laughs> i'm sorry butt rot you you had a great name you might have had a decent deck it didn't look horrible i don't really like that bat but you know hey maybe you can make it happen maybe it'll work oh look at all these things i'm getting Getting all the monies today. I'm pressing A. Doesn't want to play. It's not doing anything. Come on. All right, we did it. So, one more win, and we get another pack. And I am looking for that snapping narlid. I really want it so bad. Once I get those snapping narlids, I feel like uh, I feel like uh, my my mono green deck is gonna be is gonna be kingpins. Just the kingest of the pinnists. I hate this avatar and background. The, the background and avatar combo. Like, either one of these on their own, I have no problem with. But together, ugh, ruined. Ruined. By the way, what what was your name? Something about flowers? Uh, this is keepable. I'm on the play. This, I mean, I, I already kept it, but hey. This is, this is, I'm, I'm okay. Ooh, God, mulligans. I'm sorry, dude. You're down to six and I'm on the play. Oh, you're fucked. He's probably just going to rage quit right now. Like, he's just going to leave, isn't he? He's out of here. I think he is. Oh, no. He, he wants to stick in there. All right. All right. He doesn't know when I'm playing yet. This is not a turn two drop. Uh, so, unfortunately, I have no plays. Do I have any plays? Ugh. I hate playing this. I, I'm gonna. Oh boy! Look, this is all removal. 
no, no. I'm not playing Abbot of the of the Carol Keep. Carol Keep, Carol Keep, Car Carry, whatever. Oh no! And you kept a one lander too? Oh, you mulliganed, dude! You idiot! Why did you do that? You're fucked, man. Oh damn, man. Oh, you're totally screwed. Oh, I've got you. Oh, I feel so bad now. It's like, I don't know what other deck this damn card uh, could be in. So he knows what I'm playing, right? What, what card is this? I forgot the name. Street Denizen. Foundry St Street Denizen. It's like, that's always in the red deck wins. Yeah, you, you kept a one land hand, man. You never do that. Oh, that's awful. I feel so bad now. Oh, I'm totally going to destroy this guy. Ah. Oh. Do I even want to put this episode up? Because this is just going to be me smacking around. If he can come back from this, I don't know. Maybe he's just waiting on, like, one card. One thing. Actually, I, I should have put down Abbott. Whoops, I fucked up. Ah, oh, and I should have done that earlier. God, I'm... I'm, I'm Alright, I'm giving him some breaks. I'm, I'm going to be misplaying. Maybe maybe he'll... Maybe he'll get... Nope. God damn it. Dude, you, you done goofed so hard, dude. Oh, God. I feel so bad. I really hate seeing this. I really, really hate it. Come on, what do I get? 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 What is this? Yeah, I'll play that. Hell yeah, I'll play that. Give me that land. Yeah, he's gone. Man, you, you never keep a one lander, dude. You should know better than that. That's so silly of you, man. And you even mulliganed? Like, you just not want to go down to five? Is that what's going on? Ugh. I'm so sorry, dude. I mean, it happens. It happens. Let's see what, what you were playing, anyway. Let's, let's take a quick little peek here. Alright, so mono green, I guess? From beyond and plummet. Why would you play plummet? Well, I guess because you can't put a sideboard in this game. Huh. Not sure about plummet. I mean, I'd probably get rid of that, too. From beyond. I like this card. It's kind of cool. This guy's, this guy's so screwed. Oh, God. Oh, he was playing uh, some kind of Golgari control. All right. Well, that didn't work. All right. that That's game. Oh, I, I feel bad. I feel bad. That's not a, that's not what I want to see. That's no good. That's no fun at all. Wait. Could I have? No, I could not. Wait. Could I have? Could I have evened him out? Oh, I probably could have. Brandon Flowers. I'm sorry, man. I know how it is. I've been there many times. But uh, part of it is your own fault, honestly. I, I, I hate I hate saying it, but part of that is definitely your own fault. Um, let's let's get in there. Five, six, seven, eight, nine. Ha -ha. Let's get in there again. That that was a shitty game. I I really didn't like that. I'm sorry, guys. I'm sorry you had to see that. That was really upsetting. I really don't like those kinds of games. But uh, the point, really, uh, at this point. <clears throat> Uh, the red deck wins. Why am I playing this? I'm playing this right now so I can grind out some more monies, so I can grind out uh, some more ranks. Not that ranks really means anything, but yeah, screw it. I'm tired of being in the you know the tens or whatever. The fifteens, fine. Um, and the the best part about this deck, assume you're gonna lose. Hey, look who it is, but I can't keep you. Uh, assume you're gonna lose. Now I just said don't keep a one land, but I am a special kind of deck who can definitely keep a one lander. If, if you are going to lose, uh, you'll know very quickly. And you can deck out and get another game going much faster. Um, yep. I mean, he is going first, though. So he's going to have two mana. Uh, probably got a creature in the two-drop range. Maybe it's better with Foundry Street Gen Denizen. But I will have Titan Strength open. So that can be sort of a removal. Oop, not really, not anymore. <laughs> not anymore. Let's see if he wants a trade. That'd be interesting, huh? That'd be interesting. Let's see if he wants a trade. What do you want to do, buddy? What do you want to do, pal? You want to trade? Up to you. Totally up to you. I think it's a fair trade. Okay. Cool. Make it happen, buddy. Boop and boop. Uh, part of me really didn't think he would, but that's fine. That's acceptable. I accept you. I choose us. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> I don't choose us. <clears throat> that's not the kind of person I am. Uh, yeah, him going first is actually a problem for me. Legit problem for me. 
One land wouldn't be a problem here. If I don't get it, that's also okay. Ooh, now that's something I'd like, but I can't. I have to keep uh, Titan Strength open. Gotta keep it open. And then he's gonna block. Because he's gonna block. Because he's gonna block. Fix that shit. If I get a land, put it on top. Uh, that's not a playable card, so that's going on the bottom. And there we go. Perfect. <laughs> not really. This uh, this uh, uh, this is not going so well for me. I should have a much stronger field, so I'm probably going to call this a loss. Um, I think he just missed a land drop. Actually, did he? I don't. I don't know. Maybe he didn't. Uh, I should actually have a significantly stronger field. I need one more land to make this uh, a lot better. Oh, that's not good. That's not good at all. Odds are pretty decent that I'm going to get another land because I've been I've been I've been going through a few things. Ten cards into my deck. Should be okay. There it is. There he is. And there he is. Perfect. So, obviously, Golgari Control looks pretty standard, Golgari Control. Uh, definitely trying to cycle, definitely trying to get rid of some things. Low-end creatures that try to stabilize you uh, until you get to your bombs. That's just basic Golgari, you know? That's just the way it is. In this format, I mean. Reeve Soul, that's fine. Uh, take out one of my cards. I do get one back, though. Mm. And I got a couple creatures to put it on, too, if I wanted to. He has enough for um, Languish, and I am going to just call out 100% certainty he has Languish in his deck. So I think I'm just going to drop... Uh, who do I want to drop? I think it's going to be Glory Chaser, actually. Yeah, it's going to be Glory Chaser. Unless I get a land, in which case it'll be Abbott. Eh. I still think it'll be Glory Chaser, never mind. I, I really want... Yeah, see, now that that's really throwing me off. What do I want to do here? I want to do that. That's what I'm going to do. No need to put down this land. Uh, I have no, like, instant speed anythings, and I, I, I want him to feel like uh, like I'm low on lands and shit. So we're just not going to do anything. There's no there's no need to uh, put it down. If I get another land next turn, it's not like I need to be at four lands. It's, who gives a shit? I have no four land cost things. Uh, lose two life. Draw two cards, sort of. Uh, or is it like draw four cards and dump two? Four cards, put two of them, and then the rest of your graveyard, right? I mean, this card has been around for a while. I really should know about that by now. <laughs> it's been a while, man. I don't know. Fuck you. <laughs> uh, he will not be swinging in. He wants to hold that back. Bone splinters. Well, that's kind of weird. All right. I mean, it's a fair trade uh, in his favor. Definitely a trade in his favor. He's, he's, I feel like he's blowing a lot of his uh, decent removal, though. Maybe he doesn't think that I have uh, a lot of creatures in my in my deck. Um, he's at five. Gosh, what do you think? Do you think I should drop a Chandra? A Changes? I'm going to do it. If he has the removals, then he's got the removals. Uh, this is fine. I mean, he is getting up there. He, he's probably got nothing but control cards like uh, removals... A uh, in his hand, and a bunch of uh, low-cost creatures, and then, you know, five or six giant bombs. Yeah, there's a Reef Soul. Yeah, oh, well. I mean, I've got a, I've got a creature turn. I don't want to put down anything bigger than that. I mean, I've, I've played this deck. You, you have played this deck before. If you know what this game is, you've played this deck. This is not uh, a particularly inspired deck, but hey, it works, and he may win. Uh, I should have I should have won by now, so uh, his, the odds are very much in his favor right now. Uh, Bully's good. Bully's very good. In fact, this time I'm actually going to put down a couple of them, because I, I actually do need to have some creatures on the board at some point. I need to start swinging in. <clears throat> Maybe I should have been doing that earlier. Not sure if that was a misplay. Kind of tough for this card to get around a, a control that's stabilized like he has. Uh, but he's definitely been doing just fine. Ooh, and that's not good. And he's got the land for it, too. Damn. That's not good. Um, he definitely has won already. I, I don't think there's any, any way for me out of this. Uh, because I need to go to his face. If I go for Nyssa, 
yeah, no, this is this is game. Uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna deck out of here, uh, dude. Good game. You definitely won, but uh, I'm here to grind out monies, not uh, not dick around with that deck. Uh, yeah, I mean he got it. He definitely got. It. There's no way there there was no way for me out of there. I'm not I'm not too ashamed of uh, quitting out of that deck. He played it perfectly. He got he had he had decent stuff. Not a too inspired deck. That is definitely one of the I don't know tier one decks maybe. If not tier one, then definitely tier two. It's up there, but I think it's pretty boring. I guess you can consider my deck pretty boring too, but hey, that, these are the decks we're choosing. That's a lot of lands in this hand. Uh, only one creature. Don't really like it, but it's aggressive. You know, the other thing, if I had gone first in that last game, I think I would have been in a much better position. Uh, him going first is actually a massive problem for me, and here we have it again, uh, them going first. Because that means that they can get around a lot of my shit. So I'm banking that he doesn't have anything. Uh, thankfully this time I have a Twin Bolt to get rid of whatever creature he has, uh, unless it's a Perilous Mirror, of course, in which case I'm, I'm still kind of fucked. If it is a Perilous Mirror, I'm not going to waste the Twin Bolt. I'm just going to run in. Alright, that's fine. That's fine. That'll that'll get rid of uh, that. Okie dokie. Or the Chokey. Uh, I don't need to actually hit it with a Twin Bolt. I could also just Infectious Bloodlust. Because uh, I can save the Twin Bolt for something a little scarier. And now I have a 3-2 that'll kill him that he can't stop. Uh, it's just, it's more efficient this way. It's more direct. Uh, he does want to lose it, okay. Really scared of that. Uh... So see, I got rid of it, but I still have my Twin Bolt for any other oh shit scenario. And I have a backup creature, and I have a backup pump. So And I have a few too many uh, lands, actually. That's a problem. Oh, he threw that guy away. I wonder why he did that. That's weird. Uh, I do want to get in for as much as possible, as quickly as possible, so I think I'm going to pump this up now. He only has two black. I don't think there's any two black instant speed removals. I will keep that on the top. He's kind of in trouble right now. That's that's <laughs> that's a bit of damage. And come on, Goblin Arsonist. Let's go. Let's go. So, let's see. He's probably getting hit for uh, eight next turn. Or seven. I don't know, let's see. Oh, he's keeping it tapped. Okay, well, he's not getting hit for shit this turn, then. <laughs> oh, there's the Murky Mercs. Don't like that card. That's a bad card for me. Very bad card. Uh, I can throw in my Goblin Arsonist and my Twin Bolt. Never mind. I can just throw in my Goblin Arsonist now. Which is fine by me. I will absolutely do that, because I need to get rid of that card. Titan Strength didn't do shit with it. Uh, I'm still going to do this just for the scry effect. Uh, fodder's fine. Alright. Fodder works for me. And he's just taking these damages. That's pretty rough, man. Oh, you know why? Uh, he wants to double block the... Uh, he wants to double block the goblin glory chaser. Yep, that's what's going on. Okay, and now he can do it. Makes sense. And it does have to swing in. Maybe I should have saved that. Uh, I really thought he'd block the uh, Goblin Arsonist, honestly, but I guess that was too telegraphed that uh, I had something on my sleeve there. So, well, I have no choice. At least one of them will die. That's nice. And then my one damage will get through. I have no other real need to do anything. So, let's do that. One of his fuckers will die. He has to double block here. And he will. He'll do it. Actually, my, uh, my, uh, oh, oh, is he saving one? Or is he just using their ability? Okay. What is their ability again? I already forgot. Lifelink. Okay. So he's just gaining four life. I find that acceptable. Boop and boop. And... Sure, I'll fodder now. If he wants to languish, uh, actually, maybe I should have saved that in case he does have the languish. I want to be a little aggressive. I mean, I didn't have to. I could, I could plop that on one of the uh, tokens next turn with, eh, yeah. I don't know. I don't know. All right, no languish. That's good. Man, he's got a lot of very fat creatures back there. <laughs> he's got some good walls going. Uh, we're both down to two cards. He hasn't had a lot of. Uh, a lot of card draw, which is good for me. That's also good for me. 
Ooh, so I want to keep that open. Uh, I'm going to leave that twin bolt open first. See if I can get rid of somebody. Do I want to swing in? Oh, I got to think about this, you guys. He'll block with a 2-4. I can kill the 1-3. Can't really do a whole lot here. That sucks. Okay. Alright, I will keep that twin bolt open, though. Just in case. Ugh, that does not feel good. Not swinging in feels real bad. That feels like a misplay on my part, actually. Big misplay. Um, up against control decks, man. Those guys are real. Those guys are fucking real and hard to get rid of. What the fuck is that? Who plays that? I have never seen this played. Tap a creature I control. What, just temporarily? Who cares? I don't like the bat. I definitely don't like this guy. I guess he's in here as a flyer, but he's a six-costing flyer, dude. It's like, that is so expensive. Ugh. So, let's see. I, see, I've been getting mana flooded, too. I really shouldn't have as many lands. So I can make her a 4-3. I think I'm okay if he wants to double block. Does he want a double blocker? Oh, damn, dude. I don't know. I don't know! What do I want to do? Okay. He'll have to double block her. I'll at least get in for three. I'm probably going to pop out somebody else. Oh, you know what? I sh oh god, I fucked up. I should have I should have used her ability. I could have him at ten right now. That was a that was a misplay. He he should be at one less life than he is. Misplay. He's gonna double block Chandra. Uh, okay. If you're gonna block a one one, not sure that's the one one you wanna block. Holy cow. Um. Okay. Wow, I'm sorry. That's really that, that's really throwing me off here. That's wow. That is really throwing me off here. Okay, so he's getting rid of all these guys, taking a damage, using her ability, giving him two damage. She's popping off. Gonna do... Alright, so I can pop. He can't kill her yet. I could kill one of his creatures, but not the important creature. So I think I'm just gonna send that to his face. And if I get a burn spell of some kind, uh, I'll win. I will win. I just need um, a twin bolt. He doesn't need a pump spell. I don't think he has one. Uh, he's only bringing her down to two, so that's not going to kill her. She'll still burn him, so he's going down to one life next turn. And I just need... Oh, lifelink. Shit, I forgot about that. Damn it. Forgot about the lifelink, man. I, I don't see that wall that often, but uh, it's a damn good card. It's a damn good card. He may have me. Honestly, this is this is kind of goofy, but he could he could get me. No, no, one to me, two to the planeswalker. All right, it's interesting. Interesting. I would have sent all of it to the planeswalker, honestly. But hey, that's just me. Oh, you know why? Because you can kill her now. Two damage to somebody just as useless. I totally forgot about that uh, that life link. That actually ruins me. That fucks me up big time. Um, and he should be at two, not three, but whatever. I fucked this game up. Uh, I definitely that, this definitely should have been a win. Now I feel like it's going to be a loss, but uh, it's going to be a slow loss. It's going to take a long time to get to where we're going, which is a problem. So I might just deck out and concede. Wow, that's two losses with this deck. Uh, not a very good showcase with the deck uh, that I was just like touting this like wins constantly. <laughs> that, 
Man, all right, I'm gonna do another episode of this one because I, I promise you this deck is really good. Uh, just not when I fuck it up and ruin everything for everyone. Yeah, this guy's definitely one. Uh, I need, yeah, there, there's no way. He's, he's got the lifelink now, he's got enough mana to cast it and whatever else is in his hand. Uh, definitely gonna call this a loss. Control deck after, no, no, that's not gonna save me. All right, good game, buddy. That is my bad. Uh, thank you guys for watching. I will see you next time. Hopefully with oh, no with the same deck, but more better win. Good time. Rank plus monies. Good. Excellent. See you later, guys.